Russia have announced the deployment of S-300 missiles in Syria. The weapon system, which is one of the most devastating air defense systems in the world, will be placed after recent escalation in the region, particularly between the United States and Russia. With the arrival of these qualitative and sophisticated arms, Russia confirms that it stands alongside Syria's sovereignty and that it will protect Syrians' rights, especially considering that this is a defensive weapon. Throughout its history, since the Great Patriotic War until today, Russia has stood in the face of tyrannical evil forces and has supported freedom across the world. The Russian statement on the deployment of the air defense system in Syria has coincided with recent U.S. media leaks. The Washington Post published a report saying that the Obama administration discussed the option of utilizing air strikes on the Syrian army, specifically on the Syrian airports, to paralyze the movements of the air force. It is quite clear that the United States wants to turn the course of events in Syria, especially in the wake of the Syrian army's successive victories off on several fronts, especially in Aleppo. It is not unlikely that the U.S. military option exists in order to serve the terrorist allies on the ground. Coincidentally, the Russian Defense Ministry announced this morning that two Russian destroyer ships the Cyperhof and Zelina Du have crossed the Bosphorus toward Syrian shoes. The ships, both armed with winged caliber missiles, will join the Russian naval fleet permanently in the Mediterranean Sea in a move that highlights continued tensions in the region. Hazm Abdullah, Telesur.